there are many different ways to secure your material to your wasteboard when you're using your CNC. And in this video, I wanna to talk to you about my favorite method because even with a clamping system now, I still find myself going back to this method. So if you're a beginner, you're still trying to figure out how to secure your material, you're gonna to wanna to stick around for this video. Hey, what's going on guys? This is Edgar with AE Timber and Pine. And I really quickly wanna share with you why I think that the double-sided tape is the easiest, most simplest way to get started with your CNC or securing your material to your CNC when you're a beginner. I've actually done it all. I've done the super glue method. I've done the tape method. I even now have a clamping system and I still find myself going back to the tape because it's just so much simpler. With the glue, I just found that I was going through super glue really fast. With the clamping system that I have now, I still need to fine tune it because sometimes I have movement. I have the material lift up off the the CNC wasteboard or it just shifts in a different direction and it just doesn't stay still. So I end up going back or I do a combination of tape and my clamping system. So I just want to share with you the one brand that I do recommend and that is the x and double sided tape. This stuff is really, really strong and I'm going to show you a clip right now on how strong it is. You'll see me actually struggling to remove my catch-all tray off the CNC wasteboard. Well, let's go and take a look at that clip now. As you can see a couple of things, I was really struggling to get the catch-all tray off the wasteboard and I was actually afraid that I was going to pull so hard that I was going to break the, the glue up. I thought that I was really gonna, I was pulling that hard, I thought I was really gonna break it. And secondly, you can see how sticky the tape is even after I pulled it off of the wasteboard. I just dropped my collet and a quarter inch end mill and that stuff stuck on it. It was like a magnet really. And so I just wanna share with you that this is the way to go if you're going to use double-sided tape. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was a very quick one today. I just want to recommend X-Fasten double-sided tape.